In 2009, Dylan Baxter's path to the NFL seemed straight and true, but over the past five years, the former Silver Pigskin winner has experienced many self-induced turns in the road. As Brandon Stone reports, Dylan's intended destination, though, remains unchanged. A journey that started with the Silver Sow and wandered through three schools has now led Dylan Baxter to the hollowed ground of Chargers Park. A private workout and a chance to show his skills are still the very best. For me, you know, being a San Diego kid, uh, I mean, it was awesome. I've, I've drove on the 15 for so long and saw that bolt on the side of that, you know, on the side of the hill and everything. And just to, you know, be out there and get a chance to, you know, work out for the coaches. It was awesome. The coaches didn't really get into depth too much with anybody, you know. Let us see what you got and work hard and you know how the NFL is, we'll give you a call. To make it in the NFL, Dylan has to show off two very important things. Physically, he has to show he's still the same as when he was the number one recruit in the nation. And emotionally, that his problems in the past are just that, in the past. As a person, uh, you know, I'm in a real better place. Uh, I've been through a lot. I've learned a lot. I've grown up. You know, I didn't expect things to turn out the way they did and how they did, but I wouldn't take it back. It's made me the, you know, the man I am today. As a football player, uh, you know, I'm the same kid, same kid for Mission Bay. You know, uh, I still got all the same moves and I still love the game the same way. The Chargers have traditionally signed locals as free agents and have even drafted a couple, making the allure of performing in front of family old and new even stronger. And I'd love to play here in San Diego, you know, uh, you know where my family is and you know I have a son right over there asleep right now. So you know I'd, I'd love to play here right in my own backyard. This is Brandon Stone for the All Sports Report.